My next guest appeared on Scrubs. Now she plays Shelly, the daycare teacher on Raising Hope. Here's a clip of her in action. Take a look. Rusty. Sometimes things can make you sad. Sometimes things can make you mad. You might be feeling mangy, or your diapers might need changing, or your diaper might need changing. I don't know. But whatever it is, it's got you grumpy, a thorn in your paw, or a great big dumpy. You need to stay calm and follow my golden rule. Don't bite. You know, I've, I've wanted to talk to you for a while, uh, and, and I'm so glad that you're here. And I, I sort of wanted to find out about you, first of all. Like, for example, you, you consider yourself a country girl. Is that right? Which I didn't, well, I didn't know that was true, but... Yeah, kind of. I mean, I grew up in what I thought was the country. Because I, well, I was born in New Jersey, but then when I was eight, we moved to Pennsylvania. Oh, oh yeah, New Jersey's not the country. No, right? no. Um, it's a nice state, though. It gets yeah. a bad rap, but it's a nice state. <laughs> um, but yeah, you I... Moved to, you moved to Pennsylvania? Yeah, to Nazareth, Pennsylvania, where... There really isn't much happening. Oh, you're from Nazareth? All right. Um, but no, uh, there's like a, a lot of fields, and I thought, oh, I'm going to be a country girl. I was eight. I made my mom buy me a corncob pipe, and uh, I would like walk around the yard like, hey, I'm Huck Finn, you know? But I wasn't. But nobody has a corn. No one smoked a corncob pipe in like 200 years. No, but oddly, they sold them at the Bagel Smith in New Jersey. <laughs> So we bought them and then moved to Pennsylvania. Did you ever do any country stuff? Did you go hunting? Did oh, you... yeah, my dad hunts. Oh, uh, he hunts, okay. Yeah, he's killed a lot of things. Um, <laughs> but, uh, but mostly, one day he killed two deer, a girl deer and a boy deer on the same day. Oh. I know, I felt really bad for both of them. But I wrote a letter to the deer in Pennsylvania to stay away from my dad or he will kill them. It's, <laughs> it's called Deer Deer. <laughs> <laughs> Now, what bothered you about the boy and the girl on the same day? Well, like, maybe they were on a date, you know, and then... <laughs> now they're hanging up at our house. <laughs> they're together. Uh... Still, right? They look happy. Now, yeah. uh, in that clip you were playing uh, the ukulele, was that the first instrument that you picked up? Have you always been musical? Uh, well, I've always played instruments. Uh, I played the piano since I was four, mm -hmm. and then uh, when I was nine, they, uh, the band director came to school and they let you pick an instrument, and. He played like, you know, all the different instruments and then the trombone, he played the trombone and I was like, oh man, everybody's gonna pick the trombone. That's like clearly the coolest one. But it was only me and this kid Ryan that picked trombone. Everybody else picked like saxophone or drums or something. Like, yeah. I, I, I played trombone. I even played in the marching band, but I wasn't very good. So I would just kind of like move my slide, like pretending, you know? It's an easy instrument to fake. It you is. don't even have to really know Nobody it. Nobody knew. You don't have to <laughs> just. You're having a bad day, you're just like, whatever, you know. You don't... Just move your arm around. Sure. Yeah. Now, you do a, speaking of music, you do a monthly musical show. Tell us, what oh, is, yeah. well, tell us about this show. What's it called? Um, well, it's at the Steve Allen Theater, and it's mm -hmm. called Playing with Mikuchi. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but that's my name, Mikuchi. Your, um, na your name, of course, Mikuchi. Yeah. You, weren't, you weren't trying to, to be, uh, you know, no, uh, that's the dirtiest part of the whole show. Yeah. I mean, like, there's cookies and puppets. It's really clean, except right. for the title. But I, but I didn't know what coochie meant for so long. Like, I, I was like 25 years old reading the vagina monologues, and I was like, what? Like, Wait, so you, this is your last name, and you didn't know? No, and then, so all the times the kids had made fun of me, I had no idea what they were talking about. It was like I had this flash, like, like all the times kids made fun of me. Like, like if we have a kid, we should like name him Phil. Like, or like, or like uh, Pat, or, or Sharon. Okay. <laughs> Season one of Raising Hope is available on DVD now, and you can see Plan with Makuchi April 14th <laughs> at the Steve Allen Theater in Los Angeles. Kate Makuchi, fantastic. Thank, Thank you so much for being here.